has the best blessings is your faith. Okay? If you have faith, you can have anything you want. That's why Jesus commanded you. Whatever you ask for in prayer, believe, believe that you have received it. Every it be yours. Amen. The greatest blessing you have ever received is faith. In other words, in other words, is salvation. Okay? Salvation. 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 But you may make light of it. You know, make light of it. You ignore. Sometimes you ignore and you make light. You make light of it. That's your testing. That's your disaster. You make much of it. You make much of it. You must clearly know how precious your salvation is. Your salvation is. Your salvation to that you have received by your faith in God. Your salvation is the greatest, greatest blessing you have ever received. And that you can receive by this salvation, by, by this great blessing, you can call God, you can call God by this great blessing, by this great salvation, you can call God, you can call God, Father, 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 yeah. Father God, Father, 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 in your hand I commit, I commit my spirit, Father, in your hand I commit all my problems. And instead, I just pray for the wisdom and the, and the knowledge and the word of God day and night. In order to do, in order to do the work of God, in order to do the will of God. Because you want me to do the best of best preachers in the whole world. I just pray. I just, I just pray for this one thing. I just pray for this one thing. Father, let me be filled with the Holy Spirit in all things I do. Even all the days of my life. Amen. Because if I am filled with the Holy Spirit, I can do, I can do anything as God wants me to do. As God wants me to do. Okay? That's why I really want to be filled with the Holy Spirit in all things I do, all the days of my life. So uh, that's why I pray day and night for the fullness of the Holy Spirit. And if I uh, faith, if I faith, I can do everything you want me to do. Oh? So I ask for the gift of faith. Day and night. You can choose uh, uh, one of these that one of uh, these best uh, your prayer topics. You can choose just one, and all the other things you can commit in God's hands. Amen. Salvation, salvation. I. It's celebrated by it's salvation by the great blessing called salvation. You can you can call God anytime, any day, Father, Father, Father. You can have a very intimate fellowship with the Father, with the Holy Spirit. Who is the greatest? Who is the greatest person? In the time of the Old Testament. In other words, who is the, who, who is the most blessed person in the time of the Old Testament? Huh? 
who is the most blessed person in the whole time of the Old Testament? Matthew 11, chapter 11. Among, among those who are born, born of women, among those born of women, there has not risen anyone greater, John the Baptist. John the Baptist. Anyone has risen. There has not risen anyone greater than the Baptist. That means John the Baptist is the greatest person. Yet, yet, he said, yet, yet, he who lives in heaven, he who lives in heaven is greater, is greater than he, is greater than the Baptist, who is the greatest in the time of the whole Old Testament. So, if you have, if you have faith in Jesus, if you have, if you keep salvation, you are greater in heaven. You are greater. A child of God is, is greater in heaven than John the Baptist, the greatest person in the whole Old Testament, the time of the Old Testament. Why? Why you are greater than John the Baptist? <coughs> Why you are greater than John the Baptist? How can you, how can you, God call Father? Because you have been saved by faith in Jesus. By faith in Jesus, by this great blessing, spiritual eternal blessing, you can, you have become a child of God. Or the least, the least child of God, the least child of God is greater than the greatest servant, than the, than the great servant of God. 